Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your favorite demonetized YouTube channel. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And it's Sunday. That can only mean one thing. G-rated. I don't think we can say that word in a G-rated movie. G-rated adult films. This one, I forgot the title. Let me go check. Night Terms? Night Chill? Night Chills, I think. What did I say? I already forgot. Doesn't matter. It's called Night Trips. 1989's Night Trips. Why do I keep doing that? Night Trips. 1989's Night Trips. You know what we're going to do? We have to change up our style a little bit here in order to make some money. Everyone's quitting. Everything's crumbling. We're the worst. I'm sorry. So this is one of the things we're going to do. I'm going to pop in here at the end as well. Okay? The fashion is phenomenal. There's nothing better than late 80s, early 90s. And this has it. I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> I don't even know this. You know. Huh? What? Hmm? We don't quite know how to handle this one. That's why I called you in. Tori Wallace came to us because she was having sleeping difficulties. When she awakes, she can't even remember her dreams. So that's why you called me in. We were hoping that you could help Tori. The mind scan imager. Exactly. Tori, this is Dr. Lisa Marie Jacobs. She's invented a machine called the mind scan imager. It will enable us to see your dreams as you experience them. Now, Tori, when I count to three, you're going to fall into a deep sleep. You'll dream as always, and you'll awake when I ask you. Just relax. One, two, three. surroundings while still in her dream state. It says if she were awake, yet asleep. We've got to continue monitoring her. Just a friend, Tori. Don't worry. Just a friend, Tori. I think we can call it a day. that we're making progress she's starting to remember her dreams tori we're going to be showing you a series of slides try and let your imagination run free with these images those are your dreams tori it's true become aware of those feelings i think we've broken through i think you're right Making something that's triple X, turning it G-rated, doing an original intro, not enough. Now I'm going to pop in at the end as well. Who knows? Should I pop in in the middle? Ruin the movie like Mystery Science Theater? 
I hate that show. I know people love it. Even like my favorite comedian of all time, that's his favorite. Ugh. Can't stand it. Can't stand it. You know why? I'm a film school graduate who studied exploitation cinema. Exploitation cinema. Weird, bizarro films are my favorite. That's why I like these. Cut out all the hanky-panky, and you have, in most cases, a bizarrely weird exploitation film. So I don't like it when Mystery Science Theater makes fun of those movies. Half the time, I want to see those movies. You know, I'd read about them. Or I have a lot of coffee table books about exploitation movie posters. So I've seen about them, heard about them, read about them, wondered about them, want to see them. I don't want to see them with some lame dudes talking over the picture. Come on now. So I don't know if I want to do that. I maybe have to. I maybe have to. Maybe because of YouTube, I have to. I don't know. But from now on, I'm popping in at the beginning and the end. Night trips. It's a weird one. <laughs> I don't even know this. You know, huh? What? Hmm? I guess that's it. Will this be enough for YouTube? We're grounded right now. We're trying to get ungrounded. This is the this is the sore subject. So are we making these original or not? Does my Commentary. Oh no, I hear birds chirping. It's four o'clock in the morning. What am I doing with my life? Love you. Bye.